Yeah, Chicago police connecting all the dots here to those 30 plus burglaries. They started in January, went through March, and then they apparently took the month of April off. But just this weekend on Mother's Day, police say that they were back hitting two businesses over the weekend. Now take a look at this new video. This is from just before five o'clock Sunday morning, the 4300 block of North Kilpatrick. A stolen Grand Cherokee pulls up the door busted open. Three guys get to work and grab what they can. Now keep in mind, this is the same business that has been hit, police believe, by the same crew five times since March. But one thing that the workers at this warehouse pointed out to me today, and that is this in every one of these videos, both in March and just this last weekend, one of those three guys is wearing the same Adidas stripe track pants. The company's owner telling me There's that they have been so at this spot now in North Kilpatrick for decades and only recently have they had this issue. The first time was in July. There's only so many times you can do this before you decide to close up and find a beach somewhere. You know, it's, it's very difficult, and the employees are on edge all the time. It's not a good thing. They have to do something. The city has to put their foot down and do something. It, you know, it's just not okay. They're going to have no business in the city. They'll have no people in the city with what's going on on the streets of, the, of Chicago. They've got to do something. They've got to get tough on this. We've reached out to the alderman's office, at least for this ward. We're waiting to hear back. Chicago police say if you recognize any one of these three guys, please give them a call because they're looking for a break in this case. So far, they have uh, stolen tens of thousands of dollars in product in this one business alone. Uh, they tell me that they have spent upwards of fifty, sixty thousand dollars trying to fortify their own business to try to prevent more break ins in the future. We'll have much more on this coming up for you new at four o'clock. For now, we are live in the northwest side. Sean Lewis, WGN News.